It sounds like a plot from a movie. Police are trying to unravel the true identity of a mystery man. Time travel. It sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, when in fact it could be more of a reality than we think. Scientists now claim time travelers could use parallel dimensions to visit the past. Police say that it is possible that this guy just has a very active fantasy life uh, and that it might not be something more nefarious than that. It was this picture from a security camera police used to identify the man accused of stealing. It's under investigation what the true motive behind this is. We are exploring his uh, mindset and any possibility that mental health played a role in this. The one thing police have not been able to figure out the person's identity. It was a shock, not only to the public, but to investigators too. We received startling information from the state lab regarding the presence of an unknown male profile. The DA says they are still conducting multiple DNA tests. They won't say where investigators are in the testing process. There's this mystery person. No one knew who he was. Big question back mark in time into a case and like unidentified. This. Investigators are losing hope they'll one no day put a face to a man for the future. who so Could far doesn't show up in any missing person database anywhere in the country. Yes, my name's Jack. I'm a journalist and documentary filmmaker. I uh, was really intrigued by your story. Just curious if I can have a quick minute of your time to talk. What about? Well, like I was saying, I'm uh, absolutely fascinated by your story. And uh, I I'm sure I can speak for everyone when I say this, but uh, I'd love to know more um, about the future. You're better off not knowing. What's that? I said you're better off not knowing. Why do you say that? It's just not what you think it would be. Well, I want to thank you for taking the time to meet us today. Um, so, why the mask? I have to wear it. And why is that? My immune system. Everybody in the future has to wear masks. Or respirators are going outdoors. When does this all happen? It's happening right now. I already told you. You're not gonna wanna hear this stuff. There's nothing good about it. The official report is that Sebastian, the man from 3036, could not be identified by any official documents whatsoever. It was verified by officials that his name, or at least the name he's using, has never been in any previous databases. This guy basically has no records at all. So that's a pretty good trick. <laughs> 